right, you're reading for Sunday, the 7th of June, 2015. Let's have a look at what's coming up for you today. Okay, so we've got three cards here. The Initiate of Fire, the Nine of Feathers, and the High Priestess. Okay, Initiate of Fire, you can see the Phoenix rising from the ashes and real creativity bursting out of you. Real energy, real fire. That combines with higher intellect, so your soul purpose and your mind are perfectly connected. And what that does is it gives you perfect knowledge. Okay, The High Priestess is beautifully represented here. She stands in front of this pool, this ocean of infinite knowledge, which overcomes fear and gives her the wisdom to take right action. Now, she has all the knowledge she needs. The problem with the High Priestess is that she has every bit of information she could possibly need or use, but she tends not to act. There's a reluctance to go forward. So the answer for you today, for you watching this today, is that you have the answers to the problems. You have the solution to what's going on in your life. You can fix it, but you don't feel like you can act for whatever reason, whether you're not clever enough or you don't want to upset anybody or you don't feel qualified or you feel it's none of your business, you have the answer here. So just be aware of that and make a decision whether you do want to act or not. In terms of what this situation is, I don't think it's a spiritual matter. I don't think it's a feeling matter. I think it's something practical in your life and something that you've been avoiding or not being able to do because you haven't felt um, entitled to act. So this is really something practical and creative. So doing your life purpose, for instance. Have you always wanted to open a, a, a flower shop, but you've never felt able to? You've got all the information that you need to do that in uh, and in practice not just as an idea but you can actually do it so sometimes it's really important to recognize how able and skilled we are because a lot of people don't do anything until they feel completely expert but what the cards are saying today for you watching this and i keep saying that it must be really important for someone to hear that today that you have all the skills you need to take action right now. So please don't procrastinate. Procrastination is a way of almost self-harming because it just hurts, it feels bad, and it prevents you from accessing the good you're entitled to. Okay, I'm going to count all these numbers now. One, two, five, seven, sixteen, eighteen. One and eight is nine. And nine is about completion and spirituality. So you're done. You, you have the information you need. You're ready to go. You just need to take some practical action now. So again, please do not procrastinate. If you'd like some more information on that, what direction should I go in? What should I act? What, am I, what is my life purpose? What am I ready for? and you don't have the answers, then please get in touch with me for a private reading. You can do that by visiting my website. It's gregoryscott.com. Click on the readings tab and you can see the types of readings that I offer. Please remember to subscribe to the channel and you can also send me an email. The address is readings at gregoryscott.co.uk. I'm using the Radiant Rider Weight deck for this reading. Let's see what's coming up. Okay, 